What's good, y'all? We back at it. The last video went really well. I really liked the video. I know I've been getting a bunch of support from you guys. Appreciate y'all. I'm watching two people skip around right now. That's why I paused, which I'm like, what is going on right now? But we gotta go get this started right now. But yeah, man, I got like an energy boost. I've been kind of unmotivated, kind of motivated to do these videos, but now we're back. So I'm really excited, man. So we better get this started right now. Let's go. And that's what I was talking about, y'all. So yeah, just tell me what you're wearing. This is all thrifted, actually. Really? This, uh, leather jacket got from Melrose Market. Same with this skirt. Literally, my whole outfit is thrifted. Really? Even the pants? Yeah, even the pants. These are BB, and I got them for five bucks. I got this skirt for like thirty dollars. This jacket was I don't even remember, but the it jacket's was also... so nice, though. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, I really like the cut. Heaven by Marc Jacob. Bag. Okay. What's really the headscarf? Like the headscarf. Damn, one of the homies brands. <laughs> nowhere FC. Nowhere um, FC. Yeah, Nowhere FC is actually um, started in New York. So, and these are shades that I just got on Amazon. Just really nice. Really cool. So, what do you do though? I'm a model and dancer and freelance creative. Okay. So, how'd yeah. you get into modeling? I actually got scouted out in London. I was pursuing dance at the moment, but they were looking for like a break dancer for this yeah. uh, Jimmy Choo campaign. And so, that was my first job as a model, and I've been booking jobs. So, I'm really grateful that the dance has really helped like transition me into modeling that's so really that's cool really good yeah, yeah. But i appreciate you yeah. yeah thank you yeah so just tell me what you're wearing bro i'm wearing a bottega track jacket that's denim so tears pants loving these denim tears hat marty slides you're uh, crazy uh, iphone <laughs> you know <laughs> nothing too crazy what's and, the necklaces uh, are these just some like vintage necklaces okay. and then number nine t-shirt on the inside yeah bro nothing too crazy this is nothing like the craziest crazy. fit i've seen bro i'm trying to just you know chill outside kick it in new york you know it's, yeah it's pretty cool well, where are you from shit. i'm from minnesota oh so you just visiting out yeah, here yeah i'm just visiting out here damn so how do the people dress in minnesota then compared to i mean they dress cool they really? got swag too they, they doing their thing you know what i'm saying okay but you know new york is a different kind of place this is fashion central facts but what do you do i am a creative consultant and that's about it and a designer a little bit okay so what's your brand my brand is phase two yeah i got you all right well i appreciate you bro no problem thank you yes yeah, so just tell me what you're wearing i'm wearing murder bravado pants oh so. these are murder bravado yeah okay and the shoes are rick super nice um, and telfar bell elliot Email. I think that's how you pronounce yeah, it. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Close enough. Yeah. Hell yeah. 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 And then this is from an Asian brand called Harsh and Cruel. Okay. So nice. What's the bag? That the bag, bag looks really Martina Lee. Amazing. She's a New York based jewelry designer. Okay. And yeah. Really cool. So, what do you do? I'm a designer, model, and stylist. I used to work for Kith as their designer, oh, but okay. I just left. Yeah. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah. Well, yeah, I appreciate Thank you. you. Yo, these are always a struggle to do. I don't even like my outfit today, but I know you guys want to see what I'm wearing anyway. This is Essentials hoodie. These are Terex you guys been seeing. Pangaya pants, Pangaya, and Bottegas. But yeah, I know the question is like, what do you do? I know I do the YouTube videos, but I also do modeling. And I think later on, I'll talk to you guys about the modeling stuff in this video. Cause I know a lot of you guys have been asking me about it. Hold on, let me pick you up real quick. But I know some of you guys are trying to get into modeling and you guys have been asking me questions about modeling. And I'll answer that in this video. I just got to make a call real quick, get a few more people, and then we'll talk about it. Yeah, so just tell me what you guys are wearing. All right, first of all, full disclosure, everything I'm wearing is fake. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Tell I'm, them, tell I'm them. I'm wearing a Balenci laminated jacket. Okay. From I don't know when. And then this is my boy Barango's hoodie. Fire. I got a brand called Garmin Workshop. Love it. I got Rick Pants from this season. Ox Blood and Tegas. Oh, Tegas. Yeah, hey, you, you came out Take a crazy today. Yeah, what are you wearing? You can see some Lanvan, Curbs, okay. Rick Owens, yeah. St. Michael, Alex Best, Love some it. Chromies. A lot of like Third person on top with these glasses. These glasses are crazy. Yeah, this is the Miami vibe. Oh, you guys are from Miami? No, no, no. we just came from Miami, oh. to be honest. Check these Lanvan Curbs. These Let are coming see. out. These are Pop-Tarts inspired. These are coming them. out in the next two months. Barely see it, but... Yeah. All right, so what do you guys do? We design, work in fashion. You guys are designers? Yeah, you I guys have a couple brands as well. Okay, so you guys have a brand? He, no, we I have a brand. He, he is director at Luisa Veroma. Amazing. Creative direction. Okay, yeah. that's fire, bro. Yeah. So all good. Okay. I'm just chilling over here. What's your brand, though? It's a secret, bro. I cannot tell because. You don't want the people to know? No, They're going to check out the brand, bro. I can because it's undercover, you know? Okay. Well, Everything you. is undercover, so we have to stay undercover. Okay. Stay I got you, bro. Well, I appreciate you guys. <laughs> no appreciate problem. Yeah. yeah, so just tell me what you guys are wearing. Jacket was on Depop. Okay. This is thrifted. Yeah. These are bell bottoms from 
Wrangler. Nice. And then these are Celine loafers. Yeah, this is a clean fit, man. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Yeah, what are you wearing? This is like a thrifted tractor sweater. Okay. Got it from like Salvation Army. These are like thrifted Levi's. And these are like Rick tractor buses. Yeah, the Rick. I've never yeah. seen this colorway. I know. I fucking love them. They're beautiful. They're so um, dope, yeah. And then the Rick Tote. Of course. But... Everybody got that Rick Tote bag. <laughs> what's and the necklace? Yeah. Max. And then okay. coffee. Okay. What's the necklace? It's chrome. Chrome. Yeah. yeah, so what do you guys do? We go, we go to Parsons, art student. Yeah. Art student? So yeah. what do you guys study? Strategic design and management. Oh. So it's like <laughs> kind of like a business art thing. Yeah. Like, I used to be photography. Oh shit. So what are you guys trying to do? Uh, like with the major? The end goal I feel like yeah. is creative director at some Fire. That's like way down the line. Yeah, but that's, that's like, gotta get yeah, there. There's gotta a lot there. of experience yeah. that needs to you go. You gotta keep putting in work. Exactly. You guys are both gonna get there. Yeah. Exactly. Well, I appreciate you guys. Yeah, yeah, of course. Thank you so much. So yeah, just tell me what you're wearing. I'm wearing a vintage blazer. Amazing. Yes. A Prada sweater. Okay. Ruffle and white button down. Yeah. Always have to have the classic look. Absolutely. <laughs> Gucci jeans and okay. my Balenciaga sneakers. Yeah, these are so cool. Thank you. Where's your jewelry from? Random. Like a random places, yeah. So <laughs> I love your like hat to too. Yeah. Get it all over. Thank you. Yeah, so what do you do? <laughs> I'm a stylist. Stylist? Yes. Wow, I can tell. So, how'd so, you get into that? I just love clothes. I love putting things together. I can tell. So, it, yeah. <laughs> it, it's, it's like nothing to me in that sense it, because it's just something that I love it doing. It flows, yeah. Exactly. I love yeah. creating a look. Yeah. That's good for me. Well, yeah, you look amazing <laughs> today. Thank you. Can I get the classic egg sandwich with cheese and bacon? But we balling on a budget. I got the bacon, egg, and cheese. I never had anything from this cafe, but quick little stop, and then we gonna get back to it. Yo, and let me know in the comments, is it called mukbang or mukbang? Because I say mukbang, but I'm hearing that it's mukbang. I know DDG, if you guys know Pontiac, Pontiac made DDG. He says mukbang. I don't fucking know, so let me know if you guys know. Egg sandwich? Yeah. Hey, my friend. All right, thank you, bro. Have a thank good you. day. I don't know who's into food porn like that, but it looks pretty solid. It's cool. You know, bacon, egg, and cheese is cool, but I see people TikTok do the, the food ratings for a bacon, egg, and cheese. I'm not good with food ratings, but for a bacon, egg, and cheese, maybe like a... Six out of ten. I feel like I gotta do this every video now. So I like buying food, but I barely buy food. I do like some rating scale. I don't know if you guys are into that. Let me know. Cause I think I'm gonna just do it anyway, regardless. Mommy, eat this, and then we gonna move on. So just tell me what you guys are wearing. I'm wearing this thrifted jacket, Carhartt jeans, this thrifted shirt I got at Metropolis Thrift. Okay. Like a few years ago. I love it. This my grandmother made this. That's a grandma. And I inherited it a long time ago, so this is my little purse. I like it. I like it a lot. Tabby loafers. Tabby. For my birthday. Oh my God, I'm loving it. I gotta show up the socks. Okay, let me see the socks. Oh, you got the tabby socks too. <laughs> oh, the hat. Let I me... got this hat off of Etsy. Really yeah, nice. That's my outfit. Mr. Sanji. For me, I got a capital hat on. Always got the capital hat. Craig Green jacket. Love it. Sanji pants. Always got the Sanji. I got these ALD New Balances. This color is so much nicer than the gray ones I got. Yeah, these are my favorite ones, I know. to be honest. So nice. And what's the bag? Oray? The Oray bag. I already bag. see it. I'm gonna send this to Ray. With all the capital bandanas on it. But, I love me some capital. I appreciate you guys, though. Yeah, so just tell me what you're wearing. First thing is this top is a vintage blanket. That's vintage? Yep. Dope, bro. Situation. You can wear it either side, but yeah. I like kind of like the ruffle side. Comme des Garçons shirt. Amazing. DJ for Animals raft tee. Sick, bro. My own rework. These are your pants? Yeah. These I are, was wondering yeah. about these pants right when I saw you. Yeah. This is a, a rework I did with a good friend of mine named Theophilio, Edvin Thompson. So Dude, these things are crazy. Just giving them a test drive, but uh, it's a Carhartt rework and also okay. custom sneakers that I make as well. Really? Yeah. So Those are just, sick. just uh, you know, a little bit of vintage, a little bit of comb. Yeah, bro. You it's look usually, sick. you know, where I'm at, yeah. wear my own stuff a lot. Yeah. So what do you do? I'm an artist, but I like to say I'm a either a process designer or a business artist because I feel like art cannot exist without business. So I like yeah. that. So I'm a business artist and uh, process designer and maker. Yeah. So what's your brand called? My brand is called DJ for Animals, and that's also my name too. Okay. Yeah. 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 Well, I plug you, bro. People yeah. gotta check out your stuff. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Appreciate you, man. I appreciate you. Yeah, I love the human connection. Absolutely. For sure. Yo, so I just wanted to touch on this. A bunch of you guys keep asking me about modeling stuff. I try to reply to a bunch of you guys or as many of you guys as possible. I'm just going to tell you my backstory, how I started modeling. Pretty much, I just hit up smaller brands on Instagram, like brands that would have even 100 followers, 2,000 followers, whatever, something like that. I would just hit them up. They would send me clothes. In return, I would take pictures with their clothes on and post it on my Instagram. And then eventually, my now mother agent scouted me through that. 
that. I wasn't just sitting around waiting to see if people would recognize me or whatever, whatever. But I think the best general advice to get people that want to start modeling, you pretty much just have to take digitals. If you don't know what digitals are, if you're a male or a female, look up male or female modeling digitals. Take those and submit them to agencies, pretty much. That's literally pretty much all you have to do is take digitals, measurements, and send them to agencies where your look fits with their book. Like go through the modeling list, check their lineup, see if their clients fit with your look. And when you guys go into meetings, make sure you have questions to ask them as well because you can't just go into a conversation with a modeling agency when they're just asking you all the questions. Like you have to ask questions as well because at the end of the day, it's a partnership. Like you don't want to go into a modeling agency that doesn't really want to book you for anything. So yeah, I mean, that's my advice. So yeah, just tell me what you're wearing. This jacket I just got today from eBay. It was $55. Really? Vintage leather made in Italy. Okay. This top is from AliExpress. I think it was like less than $10. Amazing. This belt is from Amazon. This skirt <laughs> is from Depop. Okay. It was like less than $20. Fishnet tights and then these boots are like $15 from this random store called Joyce and Leslie. Okay. So. Yeah, you got the steel. So what do you do? I'm currently a college student majoring in international studies. I go to City College. I really want to travel more. Yeah, I just really want to work in like nonprofit and shit. Really? Yeah. So what are you trying to do with nonprofit? Well, like I'm just a feminist. Help people? Yeah, I, I don't know. I just, you see all like war and shit on, I just want to see for myself. That's what I want to do. I want to go to like war torn countries and see for myself what it's like. That's really actually inspiring. That's really Thank cool. You. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, well, I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Yes, yeah, so just tell me what you're wearing. The jacket is something I made. It was an assignment. The shirt is just like the vintage juicy shirt. Let me see the back of the jacket too. Oh, the back. People got to see the details of this jacket. Look at this, bro. This type of stuff astonishes me. Like how people make this is crazy. These are just some regular Levi denim. Yeah. Oh. And then the boots are hats. Yeah, so what do you do? I'm a student at the new school. So you study fashion design? Yeah, I study fashion design. So what's like the goal? Are you trying to... Well, well, I'm trying to make my own brand. So you're trying to be like a fashion designer? Fashion designer, full time, 100%. That's dope. Well, I see yeah. it happening, bro. This jacket's fire. Oh, thank you very much. Bro. Yeah, well, thank I appreciate you, you man. Thank All you. Right, no problem. Yo, what motivates me to do the video so much, obviously your, your guys' support, but yo, just looking at people who make their own clothes, who aspire to be fashion designers, I think it's going to be really cool. This is like a blog to like look back on. Like some of these people might be the next Jerry Lorenzo, Virgil Abloh who knows I think this is gonna be really cool to look back on like yo I want to ask you guys does that motivate y'all like I just feel like people who are that creative that can design and make their own clothes I think it's just so inspirational regardless what you're doing it's just like a creative process just being in that mindset where you're creating something that no one's ever seen before you got to be in a different type of mind state I don't know if you guys watched the Kanye documentary you guys got to get on that I'm on like episode three right now and he changing my outlook right now on life but yeah y'all if you haven't seen that check that out uh yeah so just tell me what you're wearing still see jacket got the four Bag. Okay. Opening ceremony marmot and some Nike tail wings. This just clean, bro. Pretty sure she is. Yeah, so what do you do? I'm a creative consultant. Okay. What's your favorite brand then? I'll probably have to say Balenciaga doing some pretty tough shit. Facts. They are going crazy right now. Yeah, I think them have got the world in the palm of his hand. Oh, what are those glasses? Oh, the glasses, Stussy Oakley. Stussy, and what's the hat? Hat, Stussy. Stussy, okay. You Stussy, <laughs> that's it. was brought to you by <laughs> Stussy. Hey, yeah, I'm all Man, sponsor right now. Back again. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> You both came out crazy. Well, yeah, I appreciate you, bro. Y'all, again, I forgot to do the outro in the city. I appreciate all the support from you guys. I really want to know from you guys because very soon I'm going to start doing other types of videos. And I just want to know how much you guys want to see that or if you guys only want to see this. Regardless, I'm going to do other content as well. I'm not going to abandon these videos. I'm just going to add an extra different type of video per week. I have a bunch of ideas that I really want to get started soon. So I just want to know how much you guys really want to see the content that I'm trying to put out. Let me know in the comments. But also, drop your questions, please, ASA. P. I shoot these videos next slash same day that I post the video. So let me know ASAP, please. But yeah, man, I love you guys' support. He loves the support too. My son. If you guys haven't subscribed yet, subscribe. Turn on post notifications for the videos when they go live. And hop in the premiere. I premiere them Mondays and Thursdays at 8.30 p.m. EST. So hop in. I'm always there talking to you guys. So be there. But yeah, man, love you guys. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.